everybody, and welcome to Zach from One of Three TV. And this is the beginning of the NC Zeros playoffs. The next uh, however many weeks, I don't, don't freaking know. Uh, they're racing for championship. Um, that's what I do know. I don't know how many races exactly, but we have this at Charlotte start off the round of 16 playoffs. Last um, time you raced here, we had Saber Fox win. His first of three wins so far this season. He ended up winning Daytona Road Course. And if I'm not mistaken, he also won... My mind goes blank. I don't remember. But he does have three wins this season. Uh, so he's one to watch for today. Doesn't Isn't starting inside the top 30. Dang, he has got a terrible starting spot. But 16 drivers will be racing these next three races. The worst of the four, the four worst, will get eliminated down to a round of 12, and then so forth until we got four, and then we got one race to decide that with crap point system. But I won't discuss that too much. Um, uh, highest starting, uh, we got three. The playoff driver starting in the top five. That's Zig Zagoon, who won two races earlier this season. Again, just Khan had a bad, bad crash last week. Um, was locked in, so he's good. Uh, he also has a win at Indianapolis Road Course. And then Space Guide, who won at, correct me if I'm wrong, he won, uh, I know he won at, uh, I think he won at Coca-Cola Super Speedway, if I'm not I'm, mistaken. I don't even check on that. Yeah, but we got Cactus King and Dark X Rain in the booth. He's um, at Space Guide, right? Yeah, Space Guy in the 22 Dodge. Yeah, he did win. Yeah, he did win. Go go. All right, thanks You're correct. For checking that. Um, 40 laps, and that means points. So Michael Garo getting the pole, non -po non playoff driver, looking to get a solid season to go and maybe get a win today. We'll see what happens for that track house racing entry. Um, first off, uh, Dark X Rain, do you got any uh first thoughts here? Oh, we at the home of NASCAR in Charlotte, North Carolina. As you said, we got we got our first ever playoff race, and that's mostly it. All right, Dark. Thank you for your input. There, Cactus King. You got any like first thoughts for this? Uh, well, it's a play. It's first playoff race. You obviously don't want early DNFs. These playoff drivers obviously don't want early DNFs. These lower guys want to maybe get some clutch points in to maybe help themselves. Because remember, even if you win today and you DNF the next two weeks, doesn't mean you don't not secure if you win as a playoff driver. Because if you DNF the next two weeks, you could be out. So that's something they're going to watch for. Be consistent throughout this round. And very be consistent throughout tonight. Yep, that is the name of the game. And we already discussed season points champion was shred uh, by a whopping 100 and like, or almost like by a whopping like 80 something points, I think. He got a huge points gap there for that uh, season points title. Clinched it before the, uh, before Michigan, which was the cutoff race. So he definitely came in clutch to get that. Uh, and we got a lot of, a lot of playoff guys keep an eye on. Uh, Nimrod and Potato Boy made it by the skin of their teeth. So did Aztec Love It. Uh, made it off of that uh, playoff elimination race. So they'll definitely be ones to watch to see if they're able to come in clutch for this uh, part of the playoffs or if they're going to be round of 16 exits. We'll see what happens. And uh, like was said, 40 laps. A lot of points out there. Those laps led as a 10 point bonus. Gotta keep that in mind as we're about 10 seconds to the command. Michael Garrow going to lead us to the green. Dark X Rain going to call us to the green. And we'll figure out what we're doing from there. As a, this is NCCRS Charlotte. Race 2 of the season at this track. Drivers, start your engines. Command's been given. Into turn number four, we put a piece of car to pull off. Okay, 
And we are green at Charlotte. <clears throat> Michael Garrow with a great start there. He's going to take the lead. He's going to take a great lead in turn number one. Side by side for second in the two. Seems like we got some. Maybe it's. Driver's bad one. Comes Genghis. Genghis Gong. Had a horrible crash in Michigan last week where NR2003 physics took place. But he's fine and he's in the playoffs and has a very nice strong one early on here. Michael leads first lap. You know, it's single, and they're sorry, single file for the first four spots. Double file on back. Take your position of our current playoff drivers at the moment. Gang is, is currently third. Second. Then it's Space Guide. And it's going to be the double zero Rubino Gonzalez. And then it's going to be the Zig Z Zagoon. And yep, then Zig Zagoon. He's currently yeah. holding on the fifth spot. And we have a battle for the lead. Then it's Nimrod. She's and currently. Well. And Genghis is going to take the lead. He'll lead that lap. He gets pushed by Rubahino Gonzalez. Gonzalez is going to take try to take second from the 43. And he will. And he's going to try to take the lead from Genghis. Oh, On board. We look behind, there's the field. And here comes the double zero. They get him at the line. No, he wouldn't. Genghis will eat that lap, but Rubino Gonzalez is going to try to take the lead in the turn number one. But here comes the 22 of Space Guide behind the double zero, and the double zero will take the lead. <clears throat> You'll block 37, and here comes the 22 of Space Guide on the other side. And Rubino Gonzalez will lead that lap. 22 is Space Guide is going to try to slide in a second. And he will. But it looks like he's about to get passed by the. Looks like the 98 of Kappa. Yep. <laughs> oh, number three wide is Genghis way high up, way wide up there in turn number four. He's going to fall back to looks like maybe 5th or 6th. Mm. Right around there. Rubino Gonzalez is taking a good lead. Well, somewhat decent lead, but they're single file for the first 5 cars. As we look throughout the field, we can see some playoff drivers mid-pack. Rubino Gonzalez continues to lead. Frank Chilton. Started in the back, he's up to 20th. Maybe expect a good run out of him today. Who knows? It's playoffs. That's for, that's for sure. Yeah, we're now on but Shard. Shard, the regular season champion. Shred, the regular season champion. Mid pack right now, 28th. Definitely yeah, he's stuck in a lot of traffic, so it's going to be hard for him to get to the front. And we got some yeah, boys, we got boy. boy, and we got also the 63 of some Dan back here as well. Aztec, love it. Saber Fox, 124 fan. That's about four drivers back here. The four lowest running cars on the uh, playoff spectrum right now. That's not good for them because they're going to need some points. And if they don't get some points for tonight in DNF, they're going to need some points to at least get themselves in somewhere in a safe spot. Gonzalez will be in a position. Lead, the side is right behind him. But they're not going for the lead here. Turn one's probably the best place to pass. Maybe off of four here. He's going to peak. We'll see. I mean, we've seen a lot of guys try to pass off turn number four. But Gonzalez will continue the lead. Car pull away. To an extent. Yeah, they're really using that draft to make sure they can we do gotta that. you got to pass for fourth. Yeah, that's a uh, Pox Cozart Daytona winner. 
And he's gonna pass. And he's gonna bring the 43 with him. Our pole sitter. Our second. We got got the well for space. That is Moon Man. Got Moon Man trying to pass space for second, and he will. As Gonzalez will continue to lead. Got some three wide mid pack. Yeah, it's really helping Gonzalez. He's a. Uh, we have some Nimrod back there. We got Nimrod making three wide back there. It looks like he, he's got. Who's that? It's like the fourteenth. Ah, uh, so far. Hold on to this one, but Semi Missy is not too far behind either. And Teeny Messi is gonna try to make a pass. And what? There's a wild Toledo in his Monster Energy 04 car. Then we got Frank Chilton right behind him. Frank Chilton served towards the back. Actually made some decent progress. Maybe even maybe actually finished top ten tonight. That could be some good points for him. There's raw pace after all. He's, as he's trying to make his way to the front. Most of the field is starting to go single file now. It's at least for the first 16 or 17 cars are now single file. Well, that's going to say that. There's some cars going the outside line. They're pretty much stretch out as we see Space and Gonzalez are slowly pulling away. But Space did get... Blah, blah. Space did get by Moon Man again. So did the 43, but Moon? The Moon Man ain't looking or too tough. He's going to actually try to pass the 43 for third again. My bad. Excellent. There's the Potato man. Boy. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, Moon Man really back there because from the 43. He's not That's more points for the playoff. And maybe, uh, uh it's not going to move yet. Faith has not been able to get yet. behind. And we got a, looks like a we're trying to see the 43 of Curry Parker. Well, not freaking Mike. God, Michael. God, can't even speak today. Michael, I'm going to pass him back third. And it looks He's like so Moon Man will drop down to fifth now. He's got a freight train going by him. Tyler Seustrain, 97 out of nowhere. Didn't, haven't talked about him yet. Like yes, that little bit and singing with, but he ends up saving it. Yep. He's a guy we haven't talked about all all the race, and actually, pretty much, we didn't talk about pre race. Yeah, Kyle Sutter. Maybe a quiet factor to his playoffs. Yeah, definitely, he's a he has six top or seven top fives to his name. Six of them came ten in a row or six in a row in his first ever six starts. Joined after the season start. Uh, made the playoffs, and his only other other top ten he got was his win at Char Roval. Uh, hasn't done much yet uh, ever since, but uh, hoping to get that uh, top ten streak back going here with the playoffs started. That's definitely something that can be as well. That's something definitely you can hope for. There's Coop. There's Cooper. Uh, they made their de debut here in the spring. Finished second to uh, Saber Fox. And speaking of Saber Fox, he is in towards the back. Definitely not a place he wants to be. Actually, he's 27th, but still back of the pack. Somewhere he's not want to be right now. That's uh, one of the front row starters. Uh, the or front, uh, front, uh, front starters of uh, 37 again. Just con. What a lap. He's back here, he's too. He's falling back to 32nd. Not a great run for Genghis. Definitely, that's not what he needs. A bit. Yeah, Gibbs Gun definitely is falling back, so he's definitely the goer. As for the Cumber Caligari, look like it's going to be Riley Hill. Look like he gains a couple of spots. There goes Riley Gorse, who is currently oh, not doing too so well. But it's not into the playoffs. Oh, we got some three wide there. There's Matthew oh, Hill. Matthew Hill. Who's currently 16th. Who went by LG Charlito. It's Greg Parkers. And Can we have Brock Brooke Nelson, Nelson in the who's ball. currently in the battle. Double file. There is portion of the back. As Rabahino Gonzalez looks like to continue to That equals a point. No, he doesn't. 
Space oh no, he lost the lead to space, and he actually is losing a lot of positions. Space got by him finally, for, and for the first time in about 20 laps, a new leader. Yeah, yeah. another yeah. note here: we are past halfway now. So Gonzalez will probably, most likely, get the most laps led bonus the last space. We'll see what happens. It's not over yet. Gonna lead more very laps. likely. Another note Wait, here, uh, two, I think uh, Gonzalez might get the most lap left. Since this is now... Since we are now on lap 23. We'll definitely see how the export looks. But, uh, you know, two Coca-Cola cars in the top five right now. And quite possibly in the top ten with Sam Oskin back there. The Kansas King, uh, who has two ones this season. Swept the Kansas races. He's trying to peek into the top ten right now as well. Also, the two Either Bush now, cars have been... Yeah, the two He's Bush cars have been racing dealer as well. Yeah, Nimrod at the moment is actually Dude. made her up to made her up to six, and it looked like Gonzalez fell to seventh. Potentially more. It seemed like he's going the way of Gang, the way Genghis went, fell out because Genghis was in the top ten, and then he started falling back. Four, uh oh, four wide. See, if you get left on the high side right, without any hit, you're going to the back. Playoff contenders right there. Don playoff contender three Melinda one, Jones two. wisely backed out. And then the three playoff drivers are Frank Chilton, Genghis Kong, and it looks like I think it's battle for 31st yeah, three wide. Yeah. And they're still going at it. That and could be. Gonna, oh, oh over. Gork goes high, and we got some. Oh, we got three wide back a little... there. Gore, Vince, Freeze. Aztec, and love it. Another play driver, Aztec. Like really good Aztec is fall literally the last of the playoff drivers right now. That is not a good sign for him. Yeah, considering he barely made it in, it's not too surprising. But he doesn't need this kind of run. I actually shred yeah. the lowest running right now. Wow, he's a regular season champion. Could come out of this in the negatives. Base. Playoff drivers are going to be playing a spoiler. That'd be a weird round kinda 16 seen, exit. Kind of seen some, kind of seen seeing some, some similar to real life right now with Martin Truex Jr., regular season champion. He's currently ne in the negatives heading into Bristol. Yeah, as a but as we can, but that as we continue into this race, the same thing is unfortunately happening to Shred right now. He's almost in last. Moonman's yeah. taking the lead since we were looking back there. Moonman does take the lead. And we got some more passing. Our lead changes, and there comes our pole. Moonman is winning his way to the front. And there's Michael and Garrow. Not so far behind. Michael Garrow, and it looks like the 98 of Kappa. One by one, the playoff drivers are slowly making their way to the front. As the rest are falling away to the back. And here comes Nimrod Copper is in fourth. Man is now in third. We have Nimrod is currently in fourth. And then we have in fifth. In I believe fifth that year, is uh, Alex Marker. This will be a very interesting playoff shakeup after this race for sure. We can see some guys who were up front before this race being the negatives. And guys who were below the cut line up way above the cut line after. This race has been, and you get left out, you're gonna get passed. Most of the field is that being any help? Yeah. It looks like we got a pass between, it looks like Rubahino Gonzalez is gonna try to make some positions here. And he falls behind two other playoff drivers, which appears to be the 97 and the. The the areas for passing is turn number two, turn number four, and also the dog leg. Zig. Those seem to be the best area for passing. And of course, a little bit of bump and run doesn't help. Here goes Nimrod for third. Or, I should I say hurt? Oh. Getting a bit of three he wide there. Blue Man continues to lead here. Get some three wide. As he goes towards the bottom. And there's Space Guide. He is behind the three wide. 
that was happening, but it's faded away pretty quickly. Zig Zimmerman. Zig Zimmerman will pass. Hmm? I mean, besides the lead, this has been an action pack race that you follow towards the mid pack. A left to go here in Charlotte. Now we're on Zig Zagoon. Zig Zagoon. Yeah, oh, we got some three wide. Rubino I Gonzalez. Think he's in this position. Yeah, they try to make a better place for the playoffs. And Zig Zagoon making more passes yeah. here. Looks like Wardo Gonzalez is definitely dropping. Kappa. Huh? Kappa Kapperman is trying to go, like, trying to go for the lead here on Moon Man. Be very interesting to see a non-playoff driver. Well, it's not very really rare to see a playoff non-playoff driver win. It's actually rare to see playoff. a playoff driver win. As you can see, oh, guys are battling for the lead. Yeah. Nimrod is just gonna be patient and hope for a gap. So they're slowly. There's Moon Man. He's continuing to lead here. Five to go next time by. We got some three wide mid pack. That quickly faded. I believe that was uh, Rubino gun again. Rubino Gonzalez. Yep. And Space Guy trying to pass LJ Toledo. He does, and we got a playoff driver way in the back there. I think that's Aztec. I'm pretty sure. Either Aztec or Potato Boy. Yeah, it is Aztec. Actually, no, it's actually... Yeah, it is Aztec. Beta Boy even further back, though. Man. We got guys really in the back. The thing has to be. Yes. Let's start the playoffs. The gang is gone. So he is in the danger zone. Tr look, and there's Shred right there. He's second to last. He's about to be last. Just didn't That's I guess didn't quite find the setup today and it's quite catastrophic to start the playoffs. They're gonna have to come That's in clutch really these next few races. You have to really come in clutch these next few. Especially after that uh, the top a hundred. Yeah, we got a battle for the lead at the moment. Lock up, and now he's potentially gonna be in the negatives. As Capperman gets around. He will take the lead. Capperman. But uh Four I don't left know to do. Oh, Moon Man's gonna try to cross over. He's gonna take it back. Yeah, uh, guys, battle is gonna be. It's gonna bring those guys behind them a little bit more closer as they stay side by side. Three wide in the back. So we so got three wide. A lot of three wide in the back. Keep in mind, uh, Shred also yeah, got that uh, three straight top two finishes prior to Michigan. After he did nothing at Michigan. Here comes Moon Man, but Moon Man dropped off Moon Man. We're Cap counting Cap two Cap laps Moon. to go here at Charlotte. Here we go. This is gonna be. A Battle between two playoff drivers and a potential non-playoff driver for the win here at Charlotte Motor Speedway. Actually, uh, the here comes one Nimrod. playoff driver and two non. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Moon yeah, Man's not in the playoffs. No, nah, he just has a red Coca-Cola car. Coming to yeah, the white flag. Say, the red Coca-Cola car, man, that's making it look. They make the illusion. White flag in the air. Flag of Capper Man's gonna try to take the lead here. I mean, not the lead, but second. Man. That red cook yeah, call, car, man. Nimrod has. Moon Man is definitely actually, enjoying this in his review mirror. Heard, she might actually have the playoff lead. Maybe. We'll see how, uh, how much that points yeah, did for uh, Rubina Gonzalez and Space Guy. Yeah. To, even Genghis Khan, you did lead a lap there. Ruby, Ru and yeah, Moon Man will win at Charlotte Motor Speedway for race number one of the playoffs. Nimrod is third. And Shred, where did Shred finish? Second to last. Wow. Yikes. Potato Boy, you can see him right there. Oh boy. So I think Sammy Missy is in here somewhere. And Rubahino Gonzalez will get the bonus for the most laps led. As a wrecking, Toledo's wrecking. What are you doing, Toledo? Uh, and Toledo is... End of the race. That's kind of expected. Nice yeah, end of the race. Guys are well, coming into the pit road. It, it, it at least didn't happen during the and race. And somebody's so. not happy with Toledo. And holy cow, somebody's got big damage back there. Some of these guys are destroyed. 
And that was the C- NCCR race, NCCRS race here at Charlotte Motor Speedway. Next week will be Richmond Raceway for race number two of the round of 16. And then we close off the round of 16 at Iowa. We will see you then. And we will be back here next week for Richmond Raceway.